everybody, before we get started, I just remind you this episode is brought to our patrons like Adam Harp, Akko Comics, Architect 10, Black Star G, Carlos, Qua, Ferris, Jeremy Vasquez, Jonathan Sandoval, Kylie Jen, Legendary Boss Hunter, Liam Kessler, Regent Rapper, Rogue Robin, Sharvor, Shawnee P, Some Getting Bob, Soda Sun, and 723. If you like what we do and want to see more, consider supporting us on Patreon and get access to episodes early and lots of videos that help us out. Thank you for supporting everybody. Hey, how are you? Hi, we're opening the pack. This will be my first pack opening, I think, with two monitors. Um, Is it? Oh, well. I don't know. We'll figure out if my stuff's weird. Anyway, we're capturing. Hello, welcome to Power of the Duelist. This is a set where stuff is introduced. Uh, Neo Spatians are introduced. Neos is introduced. He's a vanilla E hero, level 7, and he's a common. As is Sabersaurus, who is a dinosaur, who is also an Earth 1900. Uh, there's a lot of Neo Spatian stuff here. There's some more Roid stuff, which isn't really good. There's a couple more Destiny heroes that do stuff. I don't particularly know much about them, but there's there's a much bigger wealth of them now if you wanted to run them. There's a lot of dinosaur support, as mentioned. Miracle Jurassic Egg shows up for the first time. Baby Sarasaurus, stuff like that. There's some interesting water stuff. Aliens show up in this set. So, uh, I wouldn't say they're necessarily good, but they exist. You get to do some stuff here. There's the Neos Fusions, who are mostly bad. They're ultra rares, though, so hopefully we don't see too many. Um, Chimeratech Overdragon is just good. As an ultra. Uh, there's a couple more spell stuff. There's some lower rarity Vehicroids. Some more Vehicroid support spells. Overload Fusion is a good card. Uh, Future Fusion is a rare. That's pretty good. Mausoleum of the Emperor is very important for us. Uh, Neo Space is a Band-Aid if you want to, but it's not really a big deal. Is there anything else? I mean, Orbital Bombardment is a really bad card. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's a lot. There's a little, not a lot extra going on, so let's, let's go to the draft. So let's open them up. We were already set up. Let's start flipping. Okay, did we get anything interesting? Uh, not really. Oh, I should have said what my hopes for this pack are. Um, I love an overtech, uh, but I guess other than that, it's just pick up Neos and maybe the good Neospatians, which I don't even... Was Granville even in this set? I didn't. don't think I saw him. Um, doesn't he hear a Fearmonger? Did get an Overload Fusion? Okay, that'll be good for future. Got a lot of alien stuff so far. Submarine Roid, ugh. Got a Mausoleum. Mausoleum might be good. We did get a Bite Leon. We got an Elemental Hero Neos as well, again. Got an Alien Mother. That might be good for trading with stuff. Here comes Jurassic Egg and stuff like that. Another Submarine Roid. Oh, Aqua Neos. Okay, well... Ah, uh, right, well, you know, we got foils. Wasn't an ultimate rare, at least. Got another... Alright, so we got our three Neoses. We're getting some decent D-Heroes. If I wanted to engineize any of them. Warrior Ultimate Tyranno. Okay. That's good trade fodder. I don't think I'm going to run Dinos, though I could. But I've traded most of my Dino shit. More Roids that I don't need. Miracle Jurassic. I got another goddamn Submarine Roid. Uh, okay. That's better. Uh, Cosmic Horror Gengels. At least he's only a rare. Um, we got another Mausoleum. Got a Sabersaurus. Destiny Mirage. Okay. Got a Future Fusion. That's good. We want those. Future Fusion's been eroded, so it's not as broken. But it's still pretty good. Another Cyber Summon Blaster. I don't think that really matters. Got him crawling in... in whatchamacallit's... Neos's. Got another Saber Sarasaurus. Got another Gengal. Damn. Well, that'll, that'll hope if anybody wants alien shit. Got another Overload Fusion. That's pretty good. And we got a Neospatian Dark Panther. Uh, let me just double check Dark Panther's effect. Dark Panther, I think, is okay. Turn target face-up monster until the end phase. That card's new to the mouse. Place that effect that effect, if any. Okay. That's an interesting tech option. I don't think it'll go in my deck, but it could. It has it has uses. Well, okay, we got a Neo Space, so we don't have any freaking Dolphin Boy, but uh, you know, we we got stuff. We could do some interesting things. Alright, that's a playset of, of Overload Fusion. That is very good for future. We're over halfway through. Another alien mother. I think I got two of those and two Gangels at this point. Full playset of Mausoleum of the Emperor. That's good for future shit. Da -da 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 no, I don't think there's anything really interesting here yet. Dasher is my rare. I haven't gotten a lot of the higher rarity E heroes. That might be good for trade fodder. Uh, nothing else I think really matters to me. Another future fusion. Good. We're coming up on our last couple packs. We're getting the future fusions. 
Uh, no Aqua Boy, though, so that doesn't work. Uh, it's not a great pack opening. That's also not the best pack opening. Well, last pack. Let's see if we get some last pack of magic. No. Whoa, I got an ultimate rare something. Who was it? Alien Warrior on the last pack, of course. Well, uh, sorry if I didn't sound super enthusiastic about that, guys. I uh, really wasn't, but, you know, we still did some stuff, so... You know, uh, we we got things. We'll maybe make some changes to the deck. You know, some stuff will happen. Ne Neos exists and uh, can be certainly played in certain decks, so we'll have to see if we've got any action going on there. And um, we'll see what we're going for. All right, I will see you guys whenever I decide to do deck building. Talk to you later. Hello. Welcome to the deck part. Man, so I really didn't know what I was going to do this week for a long time. Uh, until I remembered that a certain card exists. You actually can see it in the preview right now. Um, and yeah, that kind of kind of drove me to test out this particular build. Uh, which I've honestly had a lot of fun with. So this is a Chaos Returns question mark deck. So we can only run one Chaos... Uh, one Return, sorry. Because it's a banned card normally, for obvious reasons. Uh, and honestly, this deck doesn't even go that ham with it. Like, it doesn't have extra shit like bazoos and whatnot. Because uh, I felt they didn't fit the theme. But basically, the goal of this deck is to banish stuff and then r return my own shit for a big push. And just generally have a lot of, like, recursions and summons and stuff. And also, I will never run out of monsters. Um, I've got a lot of monsters. And again, I, I could trim this. There's a version of this deck that exists that's trimmed down to 40 cards. But with, uh, with 3 Dekoichi, 3 Mystic, 2 Shining Angel... Morph and card destruction in here. I'm okay with the plus five. I'm okay going five over. I will burn through those cards. Uh, I got karma cut in here. I'll throw those cards away to get more cards. Like it's it's perfectly fine. Um, the got a little droopy. Anyway, um, the theme of this deck is basically to do chaos and other stuff. So got the creator. He can't be special summoned from the graveyard, but he can be special summoned from the banish, and he is a light. Uh, I'm running Jinzo and Call of the Haunted. Technically, Jinzo runs counter Contrapasto to return from a different dimension, but you need alternate win conditions. If I can just get a big boy Jinzo on field, I can do it. And if I banish him for a Chaos Sork, of which I am running three, it works out. Cyber Dragon, it's a light and it's a good monster. Three Creator Incarnate. That allows me to special the creator. And also is a light target who doesn't have awful uh, attack points. Three Mystic Tomato, three Dekoichi, two Shining Angel, that's all I own. Mask of Darkness to get back all these traps I'm running, especially Return. Morphing Jar to do Hand Disruption and load up my graveyard. Three Old Vindictive Magician to get rid of monsters. One Magician of Faith to recycle my spells. Two Magical Merchant to mill my own deck and get two spells and traps faster. Uh, and, you know, with the exception of Morphing Jar, all of these monsters are lights and darks. Because the ability to uh, targeting banish is actually pretty good. Uh, for spells, we are running Raigeki, Feather Duster, Dark Hole. Just the standard combo. Uh, and actually, I've been testing this with my Nobleman package. Two Noblemen of Extermination, one of Crossout. So, obviously, Crossout can technically hurt me by banishing, say, my own Maw or my own... Old Vindictive Magician, but I'm running a semi-banished deck. Uh, I originally had Defiz and Macro in here, but they just, they're too slow and I, because you can only run one of. And they're not, they don't do anything for me when they appear, so they're pointless in this particular build. Uh, but so Noblin of Crossout will get rid of annoying flip monsters, and uh, Noblin of Extermination will get rid of annoying uh, uh, traps that I don't like. And I'm like, I don't care if they're banished. Uh, ideally, I can activate my one copy of Soul Absorption before then. Uh, one pot of avarice. Yes, I'm running a chaos banish deck, but sometimes you, sometimes you load up your graveyard with oops all monsters, and then you find your pot of avarice. So, it works as a draw power and as a recovery if any of my stuff gets yeeted too early. Card destruction, and then the big ones. Return from a different dimension. Pay half your life points. Special summon as many banished monsters as possible. In the end phase, banish them back again, which means if so, I can't get some stuff. Uh, but generally, what happens is like we want to like do a Raigeki or something, or a Dark Hole or whatever, and we have, like, five banished monsters, we pop return from the different dimension, you summon a bunch of monsters, the game is over. Three Bottomless, three Sack, three Karma Cut, one Call. 
just a, a big fuck you package of traps. Call is there to combo with Jinzo, but also to recover any of my big boys. I can get back. I can't get back Creator with that, sorry. But I can get back Chaos Orcs that have been summoned properly. I can get back Cyber Dragon. It's a whole thing. Uh, I've tested this out a lot, and I've had a lot of fun doing it. So, uh, we're going to see if it works, and I hope it does. So, I will see you in the bracket. Hello, everyone. Today's bracket is brought to you by not being random. So today's theme is I built this like actual tournament brackets are built. I put the number one rated team, aka player, in slot number one, and so on and so forth. So this built this out, which, interestingly enough, looks like a lot of brackets we've done in the past, but doesn't look like last week, so it's A-OK. -okay. So in our first match, we have our two middlemans. David and Marth will be facing off. They're in the middle block. They'll go together in the first round. We're going to see how that goes. Both of them are fairly decent contenders you know they've been their ups and downs mars started out very low but he you know struggled up to being in the top half he's number four now now that vesper has taken back the number three slot still very strong very good speaking of vesper uh now we get to the middle round which is vesper rated number three versus dallas rated number six this will be an interesting match to see uh mostly because dallas never knows what deck he's gonna do and uh while vesper has de-slumped a little bit crawled back up to number three uh, honestly, I think technically just behind me because I keep getting my ass kicked. But they're still up there a little, and we can, uh, you know, see what happens there with whatever choices Dallas makes this week. And then in the last match of the round, it's me. I'm still number two versus Loth. He is still number seven. Uh, well, I mean, he's completely kicked my ass before, so we'll see how this goes, though. I hope to actually get my deck to do some goo, and we'll keep on moving. And Axe, of course, gets the buy. This also works out because while Axe didn't win last week, he's still like way ahead on winning games because he's won the format like five times. So even if he still stomps everybody in and takes the win, um, it will, you know, not mean his number gets super inflated that we can't ever catch up to him. Like, hypothetically, I think I would be, or even Vesper would be at striking distance of his wins if he like completely whiffs it in round two and either of us stomps all three rounds for the victory. Uh, but of course, we don't necessarily want to see that. I could just as easily go with Loth stomps all three rounds for the victory. Even more of it's funnier if he stomps uh, literally all the top three players. Like, like hypothetically, there's a universe out there, there's a timeline where Loth beats me, Vesper, and Axe to win his first tournament ever. And I kind of hope that's the timeline we live in, but I'm not going to go easy on him. I hope the deck you've just seen for me uh, does the thing, because I like the thing that it does. And I, I gotta admit, as much as it turns out that basically based on the way I decided to schedule this, I am going to fight Loth first round... Uh, I am getting a little tired. I've been blown up first in a, uh, a couple of times now, and I'm getting a little annoyed. I've got, like, three wins. I'd like to get back to at least, you know, being a contender. What it'll probably mean is I'll stomp everybody, and then I'll get to Axe in the finals, and I'll draw all five traps that don't do anything on turn two, because he beat me at RPS or something and die. But uh, that universe sucks, so let's hope that's not the timeline we go to. Uh, let's go find out what timeline we're in now. Hopefully. Uh, I'm, you know... Uh, Sorry about uh, some of the scuffedness next time. I think I, I got everything fixed. I still got to be careful about my CPU usage because OBS gets really weird if it's, like, even slightly higher. But we'll, we'll, we'll get in there. We'll try some stuff. Anyway, take it away. Start recording. We're going. Uh, before we get too deep in the recording, I do want to say to everybody, I know we got some, some talks about it. The last week's recording was actually very bad in some areas. I have double-checked all my setup. It should not be a problem. Uh, we may have to have a little bit of slower in the, the setup phases as I make sure to close all the stuff all the time. But um, if it's going to be a problem, it will be a problem for my game specifically. So if my matches are scuffed, I'm sorry, but we're going to start with David and Martha number one. Okay. And yeah, right. everything's gone. So let's go to RPS. Uh, classic matchup. One for the ages. Ah, damn. Okay. okay. Well, that's the deck I'm doing this week. Huh. Oh, Dallas just figured it out. This is something. Uh, so Marth is going first on the top. He is blue player. He has played Oxygeddon. Hmm. Oxymoron. Do 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 do. Oh, he's playing Water Dragon. Yes. Okay. Right. Or he's playing right. Dinosaurs. Because for some reason, all of these elemental monsters that turn into Water Dragon are dinosaurs. I don't yeah. get it either. Well, water dragon is just aqua. <laughs> well, yeah, he's literally water. Why wouldn't yeah, no, he because, be water okay, type? I was saying it to throw David off, but yeah. I mean, he's playing Oxygeddon. It's a, dry, well, it's a dinosaur you, you, monster. You, you failed, Axe. I failed horribly because people didn't get the bit. There was no bit. You should just shouldn't there have opened no your bit. big fat mouth. Now that's the bit. <laughs> Ooh, boy, baby. 
Yeah, okay. no, I will. I will be honest. I experimented with a couple decks and okay. realized Ooh, that's a, that's a disciple of Ridwin. Well. So I. That's, a, well, that's actually a blessing. very spicy card to destroy and put in the graveyard because that just makes it better. Yeah. Yep. Oh, oh, ah, okay. you fool! I'm only just getting stronger. Mm. Yep. Banishes no, the banisher. No, that. Yep. I would rather not have that on the field right now. <laughs> and Too he's gonna bad. Go for the side run? Yep, I knew. I mean, technically that was a good play. He got rid of the bottomless. Okay, time to do this. Yep. Oh, we're lurking. That. It was a nuts tornado. That was a waste. Unless oh. you want to set something. Dust Tornado doesn't negate. Sorry, I thought it was the uh, the other one that... Uh... Nope, Smash and Ground is uh, destroy. Oh, sorry. Victory yeah. Viper. Is there a source? Uh, hold on. Who... Oh, face-up spell. Okay. Uh... Okay, just need to calm and think about things. No calm, only panic. <laughs> what? No, no, I'm, I'm sorry. Pass. Yeah, I was knew yeah, if I did something, I would just get stronger. Victory Viper. Ow! Aha! Yep, Your spaceship can't defeat this dinosaur! No, it can't, and that is unfortunate. Alright, we get to stall out. Black Stego, good wall for dinosaurs. Let's spend another Oxy get. I guess, David, that you are all out of options. Uh -huh. He never uh -huh. summoned an option, though, Loth. If the audience didn't well, look at the upper corner when he played Vic Viper and I scrolled over it, they wouldn't even know it can make options. Yeah. I'm trying. Give me a... <laughs> He's uh, trying, Omega. Give him, give is, him a Vesper, is Vesper back from the bathroom? I don't know. I wasn't going to say that on mic, but yes, I am. Okay. Vesper is uh, the bathroom. I just want to say... Okay, uh, Lightning Vortex. Fact, I apologize. <laughs> well, okay. Ooh, that was a cool looking card. Cyber Is that a lightning vortex? Yeah, that was a vortex. Bottomless. Why? <laughs> David's got a vortex. He's played well, it before. No, I, well, I think it's a common. I think we most people have it. Uh, um, I, guess I don't think it was a common. I think uh, it, was... Vesper, it was a super rare. It was. I don't. Know. We don't. We don't understand. <laughs> Welcome to uh, Yu-Gi-Oh progression. We don't understand what rarity <laughs> is. G Gage, is that you? We don't. Vesper, we don't understand I, I how, how rarity will, works. Though. You were like, oh man, everyone should have. You were upset that everyone's like, oh, we got a copy of this and you don't. I have a lot of things I'm missing out on that everyone here has. Like another MSTs. Yep. I have no I don't, have, I don't have the Vortex either. I used to, I just thought, oh, it's a shitty Vortex. It's, it's going to be low rarity. No, well, it's, it's was weird. being banned at this time. Okay. Yeah. You know what's a fun Raigeki? It's Raigeki. Uh, oh, fuck. What's, what's the. Uh, Cosmo Convention is a fun right geki because it's also it just does okay, 300 damage as well to your opponent. What so do you have macro cosmos up on the field? I mean right? that yeah, because it has so macro weird. that means it banishes, so it's better in some cases. But just the extra effect, like I do 300 damage to you. It, it burns you, which was only an anime effect that mattered at the time, I'm sure. Yeah. You could sparks for game with that. You could sparks for game! This is going to be interesting because so far, I believe he's these dinos have had multiple, but he's going with Earth. Because it's a black stego, obviously. Oh, God, it's Baby Sarah. Yep. Wait, oh, no. does that mean it was destroyed by... No. Okay. No, wasn't this... Oh, that's that's bummer. I get... Yeah. Yeah. I guess you have to inspiration is you have to, like... Okay, wait, hold on. That should have... That should have proc Baby Sarah Source. Yeah, it was. Uh, it, was like... it was... I think it was destroyed before... Uh, destroy yeah, this destroy monster's monster. effect without de destroy the monster with this card's effect. Okay, yeah. One, so two, I think it was three, it's four. considered killed by effect and not killed by battle. But that doesn't matter. That's when Baby Sarasaurus procs. That's the only yeah. time it procs. That may be a misplay. We may have to call EDO Pro Control. 
I can't believe alternatively, the broke baby Sarah. Alternatively, so the damage. The, this is a thing. Going damage you. step is always very, very fucky. Oh, the, the, are the damage you step now? Is, the are damage you can't <laughs> yes! hurt me. Yes, Moth! The amount of times this happened in our test Skull is yeah. fucking awful. The, and and it does nothing because it's not face real. up. Mm. Yeah. Moth and I had this exact thing happen. Oh, wow. <laughs> skull, the Skull Lair Tex. Yeah. Wow, I can't yeah. believe it actually. Oh, that's the other two not... cards I can't use. A bold choice. Exile bold bold, bold choice. A bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off. Oh, uh, no. I prefer saying and beat down. That would be the same I damage. I mean, I would too at this point, but I'll take what I can get. I did pay hey, you have in your hand? Bad move. Well, he said he drew another tribute monster, so I assume that means he has at least two. Based on the math of the thing he said. Hold sure. on one and second. And he gets the TT. Two plus two is four. Quick math. David, get back here. Oh. Big rain play. Big that brain. does get rid of the Shining Angel effect, though. Yep. Yeah. Ah. But, but he has the exile for, for removal now. On the good news, got two minutes until my pizza arrives. Pizza, pizza. Well, luckily, we're not until the last match, Loth, so, of the round, so. I know. We have plenty also, of time. Also, for some odd reason, Domino's over here started doing this weird thing where it's like, hey, you want a bunch of ham and, ch uh, ham and cheese and a uh, puff roll? Oh yeah, that's right. This guy's still exists. I'm oh, getting real fucking tired freed. of this smug asshole. Chris, uh, get rid of that oh, yeah. card. Yep. Marv, I, I assume that like uh, Baby Saurus gets better as the game further goes. Probably. Along. You know, ba Baby Sarasaurus is a card that most yeah. I don't like still play today. Yeah, he's still good. I I, I think mean... it's better once you start. <laughs> <doing> <laughs> start oh, he's he's thank you, Omega, for laughing at that. Here's the thing: he's better when bear, better. Uh, did I just always say zombies? I'm a fucking idiot. Uh, just, better I mean, dinosaurs I, get released. I yeah, didn't like, know yeah. if there was a good chance to say that out loud. Do, I don't know, but I read it. Or for its effect or not. Well, he summoned... Megas told us, we're like 24 minutes into the recording at this point. We can curse if we wanna. Oh, yeah, no, you can say fuck. We can, we we can, can leave, leave our friends time. behind. The, yeah. I, I believe the setup for this to counting pack opening deck building bracket is like 20 minutes. Maybe it's only 15 this week because this set really didn't didn't have a lot oh. I could talk about. There was, there was not much. This I set. did mention this not... boy though, Sabersaurus. He does stuff. Of, here's yeah. the thing: I would defend this set. There were a yeah. lot of really good commons and, and rares. The super ultra rare game, not so great. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. Yeah. Ultra he is fossil excavated. Oh. Its effects are negated. Oh. Ooh. That's act. Oh my god, that's a play. Oh, yeah, shit. yeah, he's doing the Dino bottomless. OTK. Yeah. You got no, the bot. Do you have the bottomless? Sorry about that. Uh, my. Okay, okay. so David, what is you're all of that. <laughs> David, you're gonna die unless you have something you can activate right now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I do. Okay. I'm gonna save you. Well, if he has a sack set, it'll eat one of the attacks. I don't know if he's got a sack set or not, but we'll see. Uh, I tactical actually move. do not. So. Nope! Wow! With the big boy, the big boy banish plays on Tyranno Infinity. Our, Synergizing so well with a skull air. Good game. Feel, Good game all around, everybody. Yeah, yeah. And our, and our, and our, and our, I apologize that I missed that because uh, uh, I, yeah. I had someone... That's where you... Yeah. Start the recording, and I'll end it right away if Axe tries to counter me. But we're going to go to the RPS. I will mute Axe in the Discord. I will break this recording by opening my Discord window to mute him if he's going to be a butt in the recorded segment. All right, we're starting. Vesper is going first. They are also blue. I'll try to make, I'll try to make sure that my uh, food stuff is not being mm -hmm. picked up by the mic. You're not T-setting class, are okay. No. Um, we did a slash set, I guess. Uh oh. Slash set. Mm hmm. Slash okay. Yu-Gi-Oh, everybody. Yu-Gi-Oh. Yu -Gi -Oh. I mean, this... 
Yu-Gi-Oh. We're playing Yu-Gi-Oh. What are you talking about? It's a 90 degree. Oh, oh penguin! The God. penguin. penguin is I fucking car. spat some pizza out onto my fucking monitor. You, ah, ah, you got him. Right, Vesper, you made him do the spit take. Yeah, that car can just bounce anything. Okay. Like in my urge to to shout out penguin, I <laughs> Axe is also <laughs> now shooting me DMs, even though he knows I can't open the Discord window or it will start fucking the recording. Don't you have it on your phone? I'm. Am I gonna get up and leave the game to go get my phone and look at it on? No. Double I did fuck know you, you Axe. Your phone on your desk. Okay. Why would I have my phone with me? Am I expecting a fucking phones? call in the middle of Yu-Gi-Oh? Don't you all have phones? <laughs> Don't you people have phones? And now they've made it way better by referencing a thing. Okay. Uh, uh, pressing the pop to my head. Maybe I don't get. I don't get it. Oh, not my you don't remember that I, thing I, about Diablo? Joke, more of like this, whatever. Oh, that's just rude. I have all my shit in one place, so it's like. Well, we're not you, Axe. My oh, phone is charging oh, right now, actually, because I've been oh, using oh. it a lot. Oh. That's uh, something we haven't seen in a long time. Uh, hey, sure. oh, yeah. not really. Dallas is remembering his deck. Oof. And he just slams into that Yomi ship. Hold on a minute. Uh, this deck is very familiar to me all of a sudden. Wait a second. What are you talking about? It's oh, just water. About okay. I, I suspected it's, something. It's, very it's a legendary derivative. ocean beats. That's, how is it derivative? That's, that's unfair. That's, that's unfair calling it. What's well, true? I don't think I actually own Nightmare Penguin. It can't be derivative. I don't go. Is I don't do good at math. No, Penguin Soldier is. I do believe Nightmare Penguin was in a set. Yeah, I was in the set. I have for, a thing. For any of you major math. math nerds, you probably get that. Uh, uh, yes, it was a common. Yeah. Fucking hate dealing with derivatives. It was a common? Well, Maybe yeah. I do own common some then. Destiny and then Dark Revelation 3. Then again, commons are weird sometimes. I have talked yeah, about how my, my water deck was impacted, impacted by the fact that I pulled no Gaga Gigo except one in the reprint pack. What about your Giga Gaga Gigo? Giga oh, I own many of those, ocean, though, but... is the problem. A legendary ocean is, is common, but the bits that make it go burr wasn't common. Some of them. I'd be very surprised if Vesper's version of this deck Has includes a, a Neodatalus package. I have run Tornado Wall. I don't think I've ever been able to fucking use it. Oh, no, this guy's back. Whoop! That's the correct response. Well, I didn't know you had that, but okay. I didn't know Very appropriate. I do believe the first person to TT was Mako Tsunabi. Yeah. Actually, wait, when did you get... I, I would Dark assume Dark, 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 Dark David had. No, or Dark, Dark, Dark Revelations or Dark Beginning? I don't remember which one. It was one of the Darks. The, the, the same one I got. It. Dark. Me, the oh, only one who got it. Don't know set. <laughs> the only one. <laughs> very I, I, as I constantly say, I don't, I don't Dark use the collection. The, I don't use the collection system to look at my shit. Yeah, the well, the only maybe one you should. Because that's how you can track as them. Like, as far as I remember, the only one who. It's in Dark. Beginning one in Labyrinth yeah. of Nightmare. Yeah, the only one who got it from LON was uh, Marth. Yeah. And Everybody else got lucky like... on the reprints. Yeah. yeah. Or the is, perfect uh, top deck. Uh, yeah. Know that, but my... <laughs> now, here's the thing I know Dallas plays three wave motion cannon if he's playing wave motion cannon. So... Oh, yeah. Well, actually, uh, am I playing three? I don't know if I'm playing three. Well, you, I know you own, well, most of us should own at least three. I own four. <laughs> I believe I that was real. also a common, even though in real life it was a short print, I think. I appreciate that, like, the singular does not involve that. Right. Born. Ah. Okay. Can you flip it down and then flip it up again, or no? No. Ye okay. I, actually, I believe you can. Oh, yeah. Because right, yeah, of the but effect, you but you don't want to. Then you're stuck with an AT or an 800 out there doing nothing. Yeah. yeah. You you would do that if you ha if I had other stuff. Loth, Fair this enough. is uh this looks like this is an interesting couple of decks that either one of us are gonna have to challenge. Oh my uh, god! Yeah, no. Um, if I lose, Golem Sentry's being banned immediately. Fuck <laughs> that guy. He's it caused me so much distress. Vesper, what is your luck? Uh, yeah, Vesper. I, I started my, my opening hand was 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 Rajaki okay. Feather Duster. Okay, so you've been sitting on your staples since turn one. Okay. Well, I, I, I sat in it once I, once I saw the, well, the stealth bird. I was waiting for all the other bullshit. I'm not going to lie. I say it ironically most weeks, but I might actually ban Harpy's Feather Duster this week. Well, we'll try and get that it out. Is, of, we might, if he does it, we'll try and get it out of jail in the 20th. No, no, no. You should that ban what you roll to which that is the card. Play. That is the card that has lost me this game. Not I'm I, right mm, now. Well, I don't know about that. 
the, the one that cleared my wave motion cannon? You really don't? That was a while ago, though. Uh, maybe you should ban Compulse. I would have had it. I would have had a death kill by now. Compulse might be something. I don't know not about the actual math. Good. I don't. Some of the turns have been fast. I'd have to actually watch that the replay. The people in the comments yeah. know. No, no, no. Harvey no. Feather Duster has lost me this game. I'm telling you that right now. Well, I Dallas, you say that. I can't trust you, though. Why? Because you're Dallas and you're on camera. I have never lied. Except for right now. Yeah, uh, there's no, there's no face cam for this. But I'm just well, making tiny, squinty faces at the at the screen. I'll, I'll, I'll be honest, Dallas. There's another card that's lost you the game. It's this. Mm. Yes, Kipulse, honestly. Wow. Okay. Yeah, you died. Yeah, or, here, or, or Nightmare Penguin. Nightmare, Nightmare no, no. Penguin. Here's the thing. Oh. The two, the two oh. cards that lost. I'm an idiot. I've done an idiot. Oh uh, yeah, you oh, put yeah. it in defense mode. You didn't yeah. want to do that. Well, yeah, you get one more now. turn. Misplay. I swear, if you lose because of this, I, I hit battle it. phase, but it didn't register. It. <laughs> if if you lose because of that misplay, you should ban Mother Grizzly. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, um, I'm gonna tell you right now, the card I drew lost me the game. Ah. Uh, oh. hmm. The card I drew was the other giant germ. Ah. So. All right. I know. Uh, the two cards that caused me to lose that game, 100%, were Rageki and Harpy's Feather Duster. I think so it was just cool, flip a to cool. be honest. Like, I, I definitely did a fucking dumb, but okay. I think it was more familiar. So, well, here, here's why that's not true. Hit start recording, and we're gonna go for the... Th okay, it's gone. All right. Uh, Loft, good, good luck, duelist. Good luck to you, Megan. Win or lose, I've got pizza. I he does have pizza, and he won the RBS. I don't know if I can say this on mic or not. Hey, audience, audience at home. Um, say what you want to say. No, oh, okay. Well, I was going to say something about the game first, but uh, I was going to make my same joke. So, Axe, go ahead. I I know I've joked about it, but I also think, like, Dallas, I want to see you actually just make a deck and focus on it and see if you can just put confidence in it instead of just randomly getting it one. Okay, Ben Harpy's feather duster. Got it. See, here's the thing. When it's, when it's off camera, I'm like, I can't tell if Dallas is fucking me or not, and I'm annoyed. <laughs> That no, Dallas keeps attacking genuinely. staples. If it's on camera, yeah, no, I also don't know if Dallas is serious, but I find it funny. No, that one was genuinely it's, it's, a joke. It, at the very least, it's, it's amusing on camera. When we go off camera and you're still doing it, it's like, okay, okay, calm down. Calm well, down. No, well, today I actually had a legitimate oh. reason. This you wasn't do, like the other. Know. This still wasn't know. the other. I really <laughs> oh, so absorbent. Oh, Jesus. Sorry, I had like, to what? pause there for a second. I, you I really my did. soul absorption, you asshole. Because like, my encoding is starting to, to click a little, so I, hold on. I, I don't, I don't oh, know if did you... Did I close everything? I, maybe, maybe it's okay, like... So, yeah. It's the same thing with Pot of Greed. It's the person who opens Feather Duster Regeki is going to have an advantage immediately over the person that doesn't. I mean, yeah, but... Yeah. Only those they're, people they're open better. Dark Soul. It turns the game, it turns the game more luck-based than skill based But, guys... Okay, that's pretty funny, Loth. Am I wrong? Sorry, I'm concentrating really hard on I, my tech I stuff right now. I think the skill gap is something that is beneficial. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, shut up. It rewards players that learn more Stop. about the game. Okay. okay. You heard. It's unavoidable, but I am going to. I am going to ban. What card can I ban to just hurt people? Compare it to MTG. Stand is unbelievably cheap. I like how like like Talus is loading his gun. He's putting the noose around Vesper's neck, and Vesper won't stop the joke. That's I mean, fair. It's fair. Right. Robin's here. I will uh, ban. I will ban. Um, Polymerization. No, I will ban the extra deck. The that was. Of the extra deck. <laughs> well, that will hurt Boy, some. But you're banning polymerization, Dallas. That so that's ve it's very ironic that David says that. Oh, there goes my sacks that weren't already in my graveyard. <laughs> All right. Uh, hey, audience, do you want to see what Loth has in his deck? Look now. I'm it's this ban. deck. I'm going to ban this deck came back. Yeah, I will uh, gain okay. LP. And gain LP. LP. See, Legendary Ouch. Ocean is one of the few spell cards that I'd actually have a, a like a leg disdain on to ban. And but you know, I, I, I should have just played I my. Uh, you do. So you have a leg disdain on with, with Legendary Ocean because it does yeah. let you. It does let water decks do funny things. It, 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 well, and cards, and right. to be fair, while I'm not playing it right now, I have won the game with a legendary ocean beats deck. I like I've won a tournament with that yeah, as well. If I, I, 
It's a top can and I deck. Ban, can I ban Lo Loth's contagious fucking brick luck? <laughs> what? Maybe. Like, does that mean does Loth win if you do that? Game. What's the card? What did you even say? Loth's you brick luck. Oh, it I contaminated me. Dallas, I honestly, again, I'm gonna say it again. Make uh, a yep. deck you think won't brick. I have course. made all. Axe, I'm gonna ban you. I'm gonna. Ban, okay. I'm gonna also, I gotta be. I gotta be a real Axe, uh, Macro Cosmos. Okay. I'm gonna look at your deck and I'm gonna ban the oh, he's first gonna card I see out of it. Okay. Chaos Sword, we all have it now. Oh jeez! I'm not even joking. I'm actually just like I have faith in people, and it always comes. I out, like, build oh, all oh. of my decks to not brick. Oh, but but. Uh, Axe, it goes, it cuts the same way. We're not, oh. we're not magical. <laughs> just because, just because, just because I don't build only one deck, and because you I have an like inability decks. to build decks without other people holding your hands. I mean, that is what I want to say, right? Like, uh, you, you constantly talk about how you're not sure about the deck is good and stuff, so. 45% of the enjoyment I get out of card games, Yu-Gi-Oh! Magic doesn't matter. Is the deck building process? But what, I like what, what about but Dallas? You're not gonna say anything helpful. And yes, I don't traditionally brick like Loth because I don't. No offense to you, Loth. I don't gen, tend to put a lot of tribute monsters into my deck that lead to dead cards. But essentially, bricking is what I did. Yeah, I drew no, drew no combo pieces and no starters. Oh. He's pointing. Heck, think about it this way: in a burn deck, I drew two burn cards. Okay, now that's it. Yeah. yeah. That that did kind of happen. <laughs> and none of my protection. I mean, I mean, you, you drew three burn cards. It's called Poison of the Old Man. Uh, oh, Chuck that's me. true. It's second nature. Chuck me. I'm, I'm staring, 40, actually, though. now that you guys pointed out, Banish of Light is just aggressively pointing Yeah, he is. No, he's just, just getting in there with the points. <laughs> just like, <laughs> how dare. You! You! Just, that was, okay, that uh, is fair. And yeah. I wish I was better at uh, it. It just... I batted it because we play the game. I can't. I just can't think of cards that are actually. No. Right. Here's the thing. I have no. always. I, I will say this right now. I have always been better at deck building than playing the game. That is just I'm, how I work. Omega, I hate you. Yo! Hard summoning the creator. It happens sometimes. Do I have any yeah, monsters in my graveyard? I do have a couple. Two. <laughs> yeah. I have a couple. Well, I think we gotta. That's special Mystic Tomato. I will throw away this Karma Cut effect. for 500. Honestly, not not to be mean to Omega. Oh, he doesn't. Soul I, is something I it didn't work. It's not, it not, that was not weird. on my short list. That was not, weird. Not is there list. is there some kind of bug here? Is there Am I not allowed to activate graveyard effects? Hey, 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 hey Omega, you didn't send a card from your hand to the graveyard. Oh, my God. Well, Macro is getting banned if I lose this somehow, because of how what because do you of mean this. If you lose this somehow, Mister, uh, almost triple my life points. Yeah, no, I, I said that I, I don't think Omega was paying attention. Uh, Soul Absorption is on my short list of banned. Ban Why? Because Look at your life, your life points right now. <laughs> but, once, but, but that doesn't mean anything. <laughs> okay, Omega, I respect that you're from. You're thinking of modern Yu-Gi-Oh. But in old school Yu-Gi-Oh, a life point total that high does actually mean things. Yeah, no, a lot. Well, like, can't kill you at any relative time. Has functionally lost. Uh, well, we'll see. But the problem is, uh, I have to be able to play uh, my deck. If, if, if like, if I'm sure because I know cards he's got, he could absolutely get that damage on board. Lot is functionally lost. How much, how much damage he has to do? I mean, maybe there's still a chance. Uh, eventually, no. I mean, I wouldn't say yet. I wouldn't say yet. I will say, Loth is back. Don't, don't tell me my chances. Climb. It's not impossible. Never tell him the odds. It, it definitely depends on the top deck. I need he to attack to the White Dragon Head exactly ten more times to his face. Yeah, and, yeah and you, you need have to get to you just draw any, any of those ten cards winning the game. Is it, is it going to be vindictive? Let's see. Oh no. Oh, no, no. 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 He's going to get Regeki or card destruction. Yeah, I think it's gotta be our Geki in case. I don't. I, here's the thing. Yeah, as you guys like to, if, if my since my life points are so swole and whatnot, uh. actually playing the Regeki right now doesn't matter. But technically, yes, in the in the future, it's the best pick. Okay, well, now I've actually top decked something that actually works. Okay. Oh. 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 Okay. Oh, sorry, lost. <laughs> Do I hit? Guys, okay. I, I'll be honest here. 
as weird as it sounds, you getting upset for me is making me upset at you no, guys more than look, Omega. I'm not. I'm not upset that you're losing. I'm upset at Omega's death. Yeah. No. I'm. Like, this is like. I'm. I'm listen, you guys. I. I've. Ye, at much okay. like how so Axe shit talks, how bad he I'm goes. Not upset. With Omega's deck because it's entirely Loth's fault because he played Macrocosmos. No, what I should have done was play my oh, thank uh, God. Okay. Okay. first turn as well. Oh, fuck you. I mean, future won't even actually work because you can't send the future materials to the graveyard. No, that banished. No, future don't. Oh, no, the sent to the graveyard. That's a. You misplayed. Oh, you played yourself. Fuck. I'm more oh. horrified by what Loth wanted to try and fusion summon with Future Fusion. Okay. okay. Well, it means I will stop my life point gain. He's got his own side drag. It's side literally side. a top. It's literally a top deck now. Top deck wars. Yeah, we're gonna oh crash. God. That is technically the play. Uh, now let's... It is. No, it it is. No, that is you the thing to do. That does nothing. Did. Pass. Assuming, by the way, this by the way, this is also strongly assuming this recording is still going. Like this exists because <laughs> it keeps it keeps mess. giving me the war. No, it keeps giving me the warning. Like every five minutes when I do something, it's like, holy shit, there's too much going on on screen. What the fuck? Like we may have to let this. We may have to like after I after after the battle is over, we may have to like sit for a second and be quiet and let it like sort its brain out and uh, right end the recording. Axe, it's not a suck. All those were banished. Right. Something. Well, it can't so, be mirror force okay, because you guys have it. eliminated most of the battle traps in the game. Okay, they're cool. Yep. I was gonna say we are. I'm, I'm. I can't help but notice that Omega has picked up a card that got played last week. So well, yeah, you brought it back, and I mentioned, and I am playing a banished deck, so I was like, wait a minute, I can make that work. Painful choice. Uh oh. Honestly, this case is actually helpful. No, it's really good this right now. Five monsters. Yeah, but it's five monsters. That's bad for me. He knows I have the Raigeki in hand, but still, like, maybe there's something that like does something in the graveyard. He's gonna send five baby Sarasauruses. No, this is when Loth reveals that he has Overload Fusion, and then Limiter removes a Chimeratic Over Dragon and punches Omega for game. If he I does, like, I ain't even gonna be mad. I'll ban some other dumb shit. <laughs> Uh, that one. Oh wait, I have to confirm first. Uh, I thought you were gonna yeah, you have Marcus to confirm that then, one. Then that one. Oh, ah, uh, yes, the, the shitty one. Fair. I'll give you Ooh. the shittiest one. I know, right? Well, it doesn't. It doesn't matter because the his uh V uh V Tiger is it's somewhere is in the banished old graveyard right now. I said a monster. I pass. Oh, it's something. Monster reborn. Reborn the monster. Oh, this works. What the f- Oh mm. no! Oh! Yay! <laughs> okay, so, oh, yeah. so, okay. we're, we're, so remember how my life points were dangerously too high? Yeah, but you well, I mean, you still have a Regeki. Yeah, I know, a but... Okay. I don't want to be that guy, but... He's, he's not gonna, he's gonna, know. Not gonna chance it. We all know. Well, yeah, you know. I, you know I search. But you and and you now you mill all your monsters. Okay. Oh, you get that, which will oh. kill whoever that is. Well, you, 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 you need to know them in a set card and make it some even stronger. It's the oh, five God, yeah. actually just do it. Draw phase. I mean, I this, will this actually. This is the top deck. You know what? Yep. I, I am. I am. Uh, I'm a little bit jealous. I don't have any notes. I only have the one. Apparently, yeah. I'm the only person okay, who does. He's person yeah, who... he's the only one with no. He is the only now. one who knocks. <laughs> but he is Aww. the one who. Oh. Oh. Yeah! Yep. Yeah, tomato was fourteen hundred. I had a feeling that's what that card was. I mean, that's the monster oh, I had in my hand to summon. Oh well, Omega. If you get a monster with eleven hundred or more attack points, I lose. Okay, get let's see monsters. what happens. Loth, I I do actually hate to do this to you because you said you didn't want me to do it, but this is the one monster I've drawn who I can normal summon. <laughs> I will attack for game with Mystic Tomato in my hand, holding my Raigeki and my Jinzo. <laughs> okay. Oh All right. God. Thunder Giant. Is Loth allowed to like scoop the draft if it just sucks? Well, no. okay. Well, actually, that's that's re on recording. There's there's no, no official Mulligan it. rule, but I do think if you get if you got a if you truly got a draft where literally nothing happened. I don't think anybody would care if you just threw all the cards away yeah, and reset, but... I think 
The only case is if you actually have a feeling that the draft machine may have broken. If well, yeah, if you have to reset because broke. it doesn't do something correctly, also you should just reset. Like, it's there's, there's no official mulligan policy, but I'm assuming you're not cheating, and if you do, you know that I will personally destroy you. Um, be, be sensible is the moral of the story. Yeah, so, no, yeah, I don't think it'll I'm be a huge problem, that. but okay. Uh, I am ready back here. I do want to I want to say, sorry if the last footage was a little janky. I, I It's because I'm also playing the game, I think. I can't. I literally can't do anything. I may need to look at alternatives. Uh, we we do open Dark Rev 3 this week. Yes, we, yes, we yeah, did. Yeah. Eight, eight packs of... Was that on mic or not? I have no idea. We're going to open three packs of Dark Rev when we do our drafts later or now. Five. 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 Hey, sorry. There are five, five Dark Rev. Yeah. No, no Dark Rev eight. three is the set. Oh my god! I'm gonna start the game and I'm gonna stop listening to people who aren't in the match. No, it's f it's his supplement. Five times Dark Rev three. Yes, it's oh, Dark okay. Rev three. Yeah, but you said it differently. No, no, sorry. Uh, I need to apologize to Omega. I need to. I accidentally did eight packs, so I need to redo okay. it again. So okay, I apologize for speaking over five. Omega. There. I have only ever said Dark Rev three. No, well, I accidentally. I thought people were talking about the number of packs we're drawing. Okay. Additionally, I am sorry, Omega. In that draft, I have to now scrap. I did get Inferno Fire Blast. Well, that doesn't matter. That card's kind of bad. What do they mean? Uh, okay, we're going. Who is oh, right. Axe is, is on the bottom? He's red. He's starting. Got it. Figured it out. This is the awful, awful dark rev where they didn't change any rarities. <laughs> yes. Okay, Axe is going to okay. Maraud and Captain into Diamond Dude. The dude of diamonds. I, if I plays anything that's Whoop. big, I am basically not gonna win. So let's go. Uh, oh, All right, that's he really had to tuck weird. his. Uh, he had to tuck to the bottom. His uh, his exile gonna... force. I'll, I'll, I'll grab it. All right, Marth will. Ooh, a good right. pop. It's not my only one. Robin, don't make me hit you. I can't. I literally can't look at Discord. So Robin should be careful about what he says. That I have to check later. Uh, Fifty-three said, packs. Open Fifty-three packs. Okay, that's one K for granted. <laughs> I don't think it actually oh goes that God. high. Isn't the highest you like can't. sixty? You can't go that high, I don't think. I just. Okay. Is it, it's like thirty. Or we'll pull back and lay a slap across your face. Whoop. TT. God. <laughs> he does get to tap a fact that's just yeah. a giant fist. No, an ASCII not, art of, of a fist. All okay. right. No, no. All right, here we go. No, no, not a close fist. I'm going to set up an art of just the back of my hand. <laughs> uh, pimp slap, I see. I don't even know what I'm doing now because I can't actually beat a saber source. <laughs> yeah, you can. Well, you can still get back. Uh, Exodus. Exodus there? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He owns that card. He's going to diamond dude, though. It's a tomato. God, this. I okay, so I ended up drawing all three of my diamonds. <laughs> uh, yeah, I could see that. All right, well, he's gonna he's gonna get smashed unless you got a response. Nope. Man, now 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 they're diamond dust. Oh, what the fuck? Is there a diamond? Did this? I feel like there's a card named diamond dust somewhere. There definitely oh, is. I think it's diamond dust. There. There. There's I don't a. Think it has anything to do with diamond dude though. Something, Sadly something. not. But there's that's a, that's a thing that that. The Japanese like is, the, or people translating the Japanese anyway. I don't actually know if they say the phrase "diamond dust" in Japanese. But... Hey, I got I got a monkey's paw of a first pack in my Dark Revelations. Uh -oh. oh no, what was it? Plus side, uh, plus side. I got a monarch. Oh, no. uh, minus okay. side, it's Grand Mark. Oof. <laughs> uh, no, Grand Mark is great. I don't know what you guys. Not quite oh, monkey's paw, but first pack I got Dark Lucy as oh, level eight. Damn it! I just realized there was there was room for me to make. There's it a reason game. why I had this in my deck. <laughs> Correct. Yeah. It is exactly for this. Yep, that's why you do certain things. Yeah, that's also I'm why I put attention. this in defense mode. That was Umbria. But I, I missed right. the chance to make a diamonds are breakable joke. Hey, hey, Omega. Well, you've said it at least. Uh, What's up? Loth may not have gotten it, but if you want a. I already uh, own an Inferno Fire Blast. It's fucking useless. You can tuck <laughs> it for later. <laughs> I own one that I can't run because it's dog but, shit. You have to summon Red Eyes and have Inferno Fire Blast so you can burn them. But guys, does anyone want an Arm Dragon level 10? Uh, why is my draft broken? Uh, maybe. Do you want an Arm Dragon level 10? I do own one. I believe that is what Vesper is why, referencing. Why is my draft broken? Uh-oh. Technical weird. difficulties. Why is, why is the rum gone? Da, 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 da. <laughs> okay. It's only showing twelve. Uh, it's only showing eleven cards in my draft, and it just won't let me continue. Uh, and then it may have exploded. Yeah. 
Is it still draft mode or was it? I just have to reset. Okay. That has happened occasionally to me. So the thing just doesn't want people to have uh, Inferno okay. Fire Black. How many times right. do you hit the Zig Tomato? I have three of those guys. Yeah. Reasoning. Uh, uh, sorry. Hit your bloody. Four. Jesus Two. Christ! Another goddamn tomato. <laughs> Have we seen all of Axe's tomatoes oh, now? Well, unless he shuffled the deck and we've seen another one. Yes. Oh, His tomatoes were like all next to each other. I have now, die to but... Hey, yeah, I was about to say, you've done an interesting thing there where now Sabersaurus I have, will, I've will literally beat over one of your I've, monsters. I've, yeah. Okay, if anything, one, at least okay. Diving Dude is helping me at least shift for cards that might help me. <laughs> yeah, but the, I, I think I argue Mr. Tomato would still help you. No, it would. I yeah. just... I can't tell. I, I can't look at my deck. Card. Yep. Huh. He's gonna get rid of the diamond dude again. Oh, oh okay. Draw. Monster Cardo. Alright. Is it a Monster Cardo? Nope. It's a spell trap card. Well, was it a spell card you could have milked the diamond dude? That would be very no. funny. No, if it's not a, if it was a normal spell that was relevant, he wouldn't have said it. Mm. Okay, alright, do you have I think I was on it right now. You? Okay. Uh, I'll wait. Well, I just pulled a card that made me salty. What? Is it Raiyaki? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it made me salty. It's specifically you, Vespair. <laughs> what is it? Horus the Black Flame Dragon, level 8. Oh, well, you got another one. <laughs> we'll get to that. We'll... Uh, what am I waiting on? I... I'm oh, waiting on as, ev as every second ticks us closer to the possibility that... OBS just eats my computer from the inside out. Oh my god, you're a mad genius. God, why do you fear Diamond Dude so much? I hate Diamond Dude too, I mean, Diamond Dude's a good card. Well, I can't even turbo with it. I don't have the pieces for that. Here's the problem. Here's the problem. He's still I'm good. Facing. Every card that I would think to ban this week, everyone would hate me for. Well, well th then don't ban anything. Simple. <laughs> well, oh, I, no, no, I guess they have to ban something, though. <laughs> No, I know, I know. And I have a personal okay. rule that I can't ban things that didn't cause me or at least someone else in the series to lose the game. Well, this oh, is well, why we don't ban until it's ban. over, because you get to see. And look, th there is a card in my deck that if I play it, will definitely get banned. I'm not being I'm not being shy about the card I have. Oh, okay. I mean, I could, I could shoot myself in the foot, arguably, and just ban Torrential. Okay. That is an option. I mean, so, yeah, that's yeah. a card that's being played that's very spicy that only, like, half the people have. All it right. is yeah, now half, know. though. I, I was on the fence about banning that one, but I thought that would be a bit rude. Alternatively, I, I am definitely he had, considering... He, he had both, okay. I am definitely considering banning Dark Hole, seriously, just because you can run two of it and multiple... Uh, have two. I I ran have it. Okay, I'm just doomed. Unless uh, you top deck something. Oh my god. I don't know what I top deck. I only okay. have one monster isle on the field. I believe so. you and I both have two dark holes. I do indeed have two dark holes. I don't yeah, always I run two, but I that can. That is not okay. That might Imagine not be okay. Oh. God damn it. Okay. Yep, that's, that's gonna be it, unless the next top deck is the the third Nothing sack down? that Axe doesn't have. Dinosaur's too strong. The he has. It's true. I mean, dinosaurs are very strong. Yeah. Oh, it's Dark Hole. Never or mind. That. Okay. Or that. And you can't yeah. my body. My body is banned right now yeah, for yeah, reasons like this. Is... Yeah. But, fuck but fuck my body. Wait. Wait. Yeah, <laughs> I just did anything. Three. All the way in Australia, though? Nope. Oh, I mean, oh, shit. you might have the length and girth for it. <laughs> I definitely will. <laughs> huh. Who do you think I am? Johnny Sims? God, d heroes suck. <laughs> Oh my wow, God. no, we're that's that, that's a cut. I I like, by the way, that Axe Axe's quiet conclusion. Well, not so quiet conclusion to himself is D heroes suck. D heroes don't suck. Axe, you're just bad at piloting this guy. Well, there is no. I don't have. A, the thing is, I can't beat big Baby, attack I'll, point monsters. Baby Sarah for the win, Mark. Do it. Don't be a coward. <laughs> uh, oh my yeah, God. Man, I feel like that's not yeah. entirely true, Axe. As as a person Quickly, who played some it. test games with Dallas's D hero deck before this started. He did punch me in the face a couple of times. Throw a Mystic Tomato in his face. Do it. Mystic Tomato beat down. Yes. No, I got, okay, I have to. I have to. Mystic Shine again. Ball beat down. Nope. Okay, I'm that's dead. it. Some of the heroes have attack. I drew problem. double dude. Which would have been yeah. fine if I could set it. 
Dark Dracaratops. Okay, I can say what crew is a uh, hyper hammerhead. Oh, yeah. yeah. I, Good game, I, Max. I, well, actually, you guys know what my purpose is. I will like. start recording, though, for real, and I will close stuff down and hope. Wait, okay. Whole, yeah, I started the recording just now. I figured we should get into it because we're here. Yeah. All right. Anyway. Oh, yeah, fuck. Oh, shit. I, 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 I technically agree with Robin. Uh, the bottomless and yeah, I would also drop axe. No, not bottomless. You. More right. like atomless. Well, not this, is an inter- this is an interesting hand I've started I, with. I mean, I'll, I'll say in some test games, the axe is actually how I actually kill things. So uh, honestly, it, yeah. I mean, I, 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 Dallas, I would put the flip on you. Okay, how is he supposed to beat monsters that have bigger than all the attack points of all the the D heroes? No, then that's, that's fair. what does he do? I mean, uh, it's a legitimate question. He presents himself is, uh, and pray. Well, the thing is, you're there. You're really only supposed to play one of your D heroes in attack mode. The rest go in defense mode. Oh, it's a BS. Oh, oh. How, am I, how am I supposed to win if I never draw dogma? Um, that's actually a good question. You kind of aren't. That that it's is fair. Good. There are some decks that you just don't do well, the welcome thing. Welcome to the drawback of D heroes. I put an extra copy of the drop, but I never did. Yeah, you, you're supposed to run two because he is your win cone. And I just never draw him ever. <laughs> That's Omega saw in test games. Dogma hurts. It does. Dogma it's, is a uh, like like if a- if X had gotten a Turbo Dogma, somebody would probably be thinking about: Is it okay that there are multiple people who can play this deck? Anyway, I've hard I... summoned Sidra over my my vindictive. Ah. Oh, that is a choice. That is. Made. I don't even know what my like my things are lacking because it's like honestly, mm. I wish it, it I had I could dive into more. Yeah, another ego. Honestly, anyway, he's very big. Like, it's honestly, it's, other, than, uh, other than a little bit of trap load, yes. Like, your deck has a little bit of trap load, and I still say ditch Sangen. Get loose! Sangen, I, I, I ditch the Sangen. Yeah. Yeah, Sangen is, doesn't do anything. And honestly, if you have uh, a The Spare, I may have drawn a lot of trap cards in my opening hand. And, honestly, and had an Old Vindictive and a Sidra. Well, if you had so, a Gear Creed, I would swap uh, Zumbriah for Gear Creed. Come on. So I, I hate to interrupt you guys, but I will we say we should points. move on from the deck at the moment. Oh, uh, I'm so at least at least I'm so at least put people in the duel. I don't care. Oh. Okay. okay, so uh, uh, that means I have to ruin the recording by opening Discord to mute Dallas. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm, kidding. I'm also joking. Yeah. I know. Hard to tell. Uh, oh, why are you? Why, why are you? Why are you trying to clap at me, X? On Maybe camera. we should talk like this. Okay, don't do that. So Please don't do that. I will ask for you to be <laughs> muted too. Please don't. I banish a light in the dark. Sort of. Uh, I, I thought Omega was about to say I banish Loth and Dallas. <laughs> I mean, that, that does have an L and a D in it. Am I, can I, mean, I do chaos? That, that's also the joke, yes. So, I, I so does that mean you're... Does, 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 my heart. does that mean you're uh, Loth and my love child? Oh, Interesting. Jesus, Are you gonna do stuff. it? Yeah. Mark. I'm, 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 okay. I, I I'm happy that you won. I just I wish I actually did a thing. Hey. <laughs> well, now Ax knows how I felt out of a couple of our finals. No. Yeah. It's like. I just, oh, you get to uh, set. Wow. Damn. Something. By the way, I want to let everybody know Vesper is playing Ultimate Offering on the board. That is yeah, right. no, yeah. That yeah, that's right. And in that same vein, Ax, I I kind of uh, am I upset wish I that my deck made Omega go. <laughs> I wish I did something in the last eight ge- or seven games uh, I played. I don't have to tell you, Dallas. I mean, <laughs> hey, like, I, not not uh, to not to talk bad on Marth because he's done very well for himself. But Marth started out that way for a long time. That's true. Yeah. yeah. What the fuck is that card? Metalizing uh, Paralyzed Lunatite. Yeah. It's a card that does stuff. Metalizing Paralyzed Lunatite. I've never seen this before. Jesus. It does stuff. Did Robin put you into this? No. No, I didn't. What is this I mean, this card? is a this is a te- well, you can you fucking mean, no, read I it. Didn't. No, Are I didn't. you actually a person that you and Robin are the same person? I mean, they're never in the same. I mean, call. they are basically they're, they're never like, in the same call together. I mean, it's not hundred percent true. <laughs> As I'm saying <laughs> over my Discord, and they're both right there. <laughs> this is very. Confusing. I had to stop myself because, like, what the fuck? Also, spoiler: they both play D and D every week. <laughs> with us. I mean, I mean, sad. they're also. I will forever say they're actually just. Blood, they're, they are just blood siblings. Ooh. Oh no, they're, 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 they're they're they are. They are in some ways, they are the same person. 
But they're not literally they're, the same. They're, no, they're like they're blood brothers, okay. but they're spiritually. It's asking you to chain every single time. I'm I'm starting to wonder what the hell that back row is. Is it Book of Moon? Because that does that. It's a thing. That it won't it won't stop asking me to chain no. Like strike ninja. Every two seconds. Hey, hey game! You wanna activate strike it's only, ninja? As I've learned it, it, it doesn't remind you even because it only works for the uh, it's so. it. book, book the Navi of Dark book Souls. That the Navi of Dark Souls? <laughs> <laughs> nah. Bob, are we okay? Okay. Uh damn it, that song instantly got stuck in my head now. Thank you, Dallas. I now got chemical no, my chemical romance on the brain. Please don't. I have normal chain turned off. Why are you doing it every time? Uh, okay, Omega. Uh, can I invoke the re or the re mulligan clause? Did you get a draw from from Cyberdark that was absolutely so, nothing? The last seven packs I have opened in Cyberdark Impact, the rare has been Iris the Earth Mother. Mmm. -hmm. Okay. Oh, seven. Okay. I mean, what I'll, I'll say this: if you this? don't finish, what are you do about this, huh? Yeah, I'm just gonna stop right now. I'm gonna call four. Nope. This is a oh, lot. Just the wrong choice. Yeah, <laughs> like, you're, you're, just, you're, just uh, crash your internet explosion. Well, I, I also like crash. you could argue like, well, I think it's a bug. I've gotten the same rare seven times in a row. That doesn't seem natural. Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, mm. what the fuck is this? And then and then say that oh hey my my internet crashed. no you just say, I close I, I I closed the tab in rage and I'm sorry I'm I mean and honestly <laughs> if I was gonna cheat on any set would it really be Cyber Dark Impact no yeah. <laughs> what's the benefit for that <laughs> just just instantly I hear Again, yes I and don't no even know the in Cyber Dark okay. right now really uh, what, what, what's actually worth remembering about it besides okay. the set no, there are a lot of really good commons in oh here. that's a good one oh, I want okay. to get rid of are there any like important rare cards in nope. there. Oh, wait, rares? Rare or... Maybe. Rare or above? No, I'm not above rare. Oh, okay. All of the supers and ultra rares are... I've, I, I've already lost. I'm going to open the set list now. Mm. Ginormous piles of geeky. What have I got? What have I got? There is Cyber Shadow Garden, uh, which is... I, I, I love that green. I love that Green Day album. Dude, Hell yeah, Cyber... We're, we're talking Mario. about nonsense about Cyber Dark Impact, but we are having a semifinals game of Yu-Gi-Oh! right now. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah. no. I mean, if you want an honesty, that's all you had to say. Uh, oh, no. What is he doing? Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 Jesus Christ! Oh, oh, oh! I mean, I, I mean, I think like, you're playing ultimate really offering. Hard. I'm not sure I want to hear that from you. That's fair. Uh, I mean, Don't be a hypocrite. Look, and that is perfect. Oh, hypocrite is here, but you can't. Oh, it's mask. Hey, I'm gonna like get that. return back. I don't like it. Oh my God! Someone can play. Oh, cool! Is actually like, are these fire cards actually? Wait, is this a decent know. super rare in this set? What is this card? I've literally never seen. Dallas, this have you found a card that is good? I don't know. I don't believe you. It's, it's called. Okay? It's called Storm Shooter. Oh, it's, uh, yeah, it's actually not a bad uh, yeah. card. Interesting. Oh, wait, no, it's, uh, wait, no, wait, no, no, wait, no, no, it's level seven. It's you actually move it. You can move it to <laughs> another zone, or you can return one spell, trap, or monster on the side of the field in the same column. That's not that great. His a level. Oh seven. yeah, it's also a twenty three hundred attacker. Never mind, it's awful. Yeah, yeah. It, it, if it was a level the, six, the, it'd be better. The stats are not great. Yeah, but, 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 but is it as chat as Beast Warrior of Ares or whatever the hell that card is I mean, you called? Can actually that one like, that becomes in. like two K if it's in the same. Oh yeah, Dallas, did monster. you get an instant fusion? Uh, I mean, yes, I've got. No, I've got an. It's a common. Fusion. You should get it. I've got an instant fusion and in, in this one, and already three of my chain strikes. So. Cool. I mean, I'll say this. You know, mm. you know what's a great rare to get in Dark Revelations Volume Three? What? What? Flint. Coal. Mm. No, just flint. Well, to be and fair. Oh God, you again. Oh God, I got another. What is this card? Cyber Esper. Oh, I think it's something actually okay. Oh, that's a, no, that's it's not. Oh, okay. I mean... Oh, oh right, it's when a face attack is... That, that's, that's bad. Why can't you be face up? Uh, guys, I need you to stop doing that for a second, because I have to... Uh... We're, having a, we're having a game right now, guys. You're getting uh, beaten to shit Oh, there's off. my button. Yeah, I have to surrender. I drew I the mean, creator. Not... Oh, shit, really? Yeah, I had nothing. I had no monsters I could... I The only thing I could do would activate return to get back side drag. It wouldn't, it wouldn't get over the legendary beats. I would die. And I guess, I guess this is where... Oh. Marf, I'm gonna start the recording. We're doing the finale. We're not gonna talk about Dallas playing Cyber Dark Dragon. Let's go to RPS. Sorry. Everybody, bundle I know, in. Not, I know we talked about not talking about this, but I just want to say I got the best car from Dark Revelations Three. Okay. Sandwich. Is, it, is anybody gonna gonna bundle into the the spectate? There's only yeah. three of us. Oh, oh sure. 
Sorry. If you want to be able Sorry. to, like, you guys can just. I feel like quite a few matches in a row. Not to throw shade at anybody in particular, but quite a few matches we've not been paying attention. But I want to yeah. give you the option. I've paid attention to every match. I don't believe I've been, you. I've been trying. I, I see. I'm on ADD medication, so so mm. it makes it really easy. All right, easy Marth to is play. first. He is red player at the bottom. I'm on drugs. Like, what is it you I did actually think I, find, think I found a process <laughs> that cleaned up my my OBS a little. <laughs> no, no. Okay, no, no. It was fine the first Martha, time. Martha, the tea set. Misper's thinking this, very hard about what they're doing. This is when Misper yeah. plays some um, quick place though. No, oh, Marth what down the tea set. He's gonna brew up some trouble. Bottom yeah. immediately. Might as well get rid of that turn. Get rid of that gaggle fuck, whatever his name is. Gaga Gigo. Yeah, that's yep, there that's it is. Now. Hyper Hammerhead. Hmm. Okay. Sack. Oh. Nope. Oh, this is a weird hand. Is, is this going to turn out that Omega My Duel is going to be the longest one we have? Possibly. It was like 12 minutes. Possibly. I mean, Though the opener know, between Marth and David was like 10 minutes. You and Omega seem to have a habit for doing long duels. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. What does this thing say? Okay, we're going to this card's test for attack. He's got, he's got battle. He's got battle function prevention. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, so that's what... What he's resolving is adding okay. counters. Okay. Like, I, I, like, I had no... It's, 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 it's not optional. Right? Yeah, I know. I was just reading it. Yeah, you also... You punch it three times, or it punches you three times. It, it, it did. Mm. Okay, it's I'll a boss. Let that go. Yeah. It's got two BS counters. So, Marth just needs to take a future card, uh, counter vacuum or whatever, and uh, get rid of all of them. I think that's in an upcoming set. Huh. Okay. Uh, if you want to talk to me, send me a DM. That way we don't talk about everything else. Rude. Smash him. How rude! Oh god, no. Sorry, I just looked over what Robin posted. <laughs> just guns. Um, I'll say this. I'll say this because I'm getting cool awkward. Sil the silence is getting too awkward. Uh, my ending count was two horn, or no, sorry, not two horn. Two edge, two keel, one horn. Okay, what two? And, and, yes, no, I just. I, I realize they're super rare. It's funny that Dallas said to to uh, get rid of the awkward silence. I was actually about to say at that specific moment, hey, that thing looks like Shuma Goraf. We were, we were just having a very, a very quiet quiet moment in the duel. Oh, and, and that's two for Paul. The uh, spare needs to find a way to get monsters to stick on the board. Okay. That, that's a problem I'm having right now. I can't believe uh, Vesper is playing a legendary brick. I don't think it has anything to do with bricks. I think it has everything to do with the fact that Marth has f uh, three spell traps. Well, okay, there we go. That's the thing. Okay. I have enough of that fucker. All right. I'm tired of this dude. Reasoning! Reasoning! Four. Four. Ooh, reasoning into the, into the monarch off the top. Holy shit. Yep. Oof. Oh. This is what we call a big bra moment. Stone Cold. Alright, I didn't get anything. Big Monarch. Big! I wish I had more. Man, I smash and ground. Rude! Rude! I wish I had more than just my one copy of Festalos and I could do funny Monarch things, but alas, I did not get I that mean, luck. I, I didn't have Mobius until just now, which is why I'm running Water Beats. Oh, this fair week. enough. I, I got double Mobius off the tournament packs last week. Two of the statues are. Oh, solid Andy choice. Indeed. Oh, that's the one, that's one card that's actually important. <laughs> Axe is not paying attention to the duel. Oop, Yomi yep. ship. That'll get rid of that saber source. Yep. Yomi! 
Yeah, we ship good that tech. This gonna happen. Hey. Pretty funny. I, hey, I gave a reason as to why I did my draft early. I also I make just, his permission. My, I, my heart I, is empty right I now. Did too. I did too. I was exceptionally salty. I feel empty right now. Uh, honestly, most people who lose round one are usually a little salty. That's why I kind of like the, the bands at the end, because you guys have a chance to desalinate and put your brains on. Oh my god, Martha's found his... I just round. Cool. Well, you know he's out of them. You know he's run out. And he's playing premature. The problem that's going to make me salty is that you guys are going to ban, and I'm going to look at this finals match, and you're not going to do anything about any of the cards that are played here, and I'm just going to be like... Oh, I know, I know what I'm banning. I'm not Don't worry. Gonna lie. I've considered schwacking premature. I've definitely thought about it. Premature, well, pre I mean, premature is a card that is banned in real life. Whoop, that's a thing. That, that's a card I'm actually thinking about schwacking. Is that just oh, okay? So, back? so we're all thinking about premature. Okay, wait a second. Oh no. No, that was I'm talking about heavy storm because he hates ultra removal. He he can't stand those cards. I really can't. Well, you know, I mean, the thing about Heavy Storm is it's a card that's banned in real life, where HFD is, is finally limited to one for a reason, because Storm lets you do really obnoxious things. Storm but the only person who does obnoxious okay. things is Dallas, and maybe Mars sometimes. True. Omega, I want. I, don't want I did it once in like round three. Uh, I've paid my dues, but with my legit beater wins for Chain Energy. Also, I don't want you to call my next degenerate when I just do random shit. Oh, hey, second But you make degenerate decks. All right, Marth wins, though. Uh, grounds for tur That's torrential. Uh, yeah. So, uh, we... Hey, good right, game, Mr. Good game. That was hey, the thing. You guys played through there. some cards. All right, so uh, Marth wins. He gets to open whatever tournament pack that's in my schedule that I'm not looking at right now. We'll see you guys in the ban list. Okay. Mm -hmm. I have started the recording. So, uh, mm -hmm. it's time for the ban. It's time to shake up and redefine the format. Maybe. Uh, so we're going to start with David. You are our first round, first loser. What card do you wish to ban? Uh, I actually want to hit uh, Premature Burial. Okay. Very well. Uh, okay. Premature yeah. Burial. Fine Getting by some me. use in the, in the later games. Yep. That's fine by me. It is, it is interesting that out of our, our slew of old school revival cards, Premature is the one that is currently That's banned in the game, whereas Call, oh. I think, is unlimited, and Monster Reboard is limited to one. It's because of the interaction. If you return Premi to your hand, it can... Yeah. And it's, I, it's, I, I want to throw this out there. Really Marth does own a giant True Nade, and I believe he showed me that he's running it in that deck. So Yes, I do have yeah, it. So he's got the, the abuse combo. All right, so also, Premature Burial. Also, Fossil Excavation, if at least a field destroys the monster, so... Yeah. Yeah, okay, where so I don't think premature burial specifies. That. No, premature and yeah, call premature, don't. They have to be destroyed to destroy. Yes, yeah, it is. Fossil I, is pretty much mm -hmm. a lesser version of call. Yes, it's the way mm -hmm. of it being an equipped spell, basically. Guys, yeah. yep. now I, I know you're trying to stall this for as long as possible, but okay. Dallas is our second round first loser. Dallas, no, what he's, card he's, are you banning? The I'm the second loser. He's the fourth. Anyway. Uh, my brain hurts. Dallas, what are you banning? I don't, I don't care. What do you got? What's, what's you don't care? Oh, you don't care? <laughs> oh, okay, he does. Oh. <laughs> uh, no. Um, well, you see, he can't actually ban Herpes Feather Duster, because then he can't hold that over our heads. No, I could. I don't actually care about holding it over anyone's head. Oh. Um, this is why you should, you should push stop. Don't, don't, don't test me, please. No, just or what, what, what do you got? Care, actually. Um, although I do think a fairer ban hit, uh, for many of the reasons listed, is Heavy Storm, because being able to control to destroy your own stuff is also beneficial, especially with certain cards that are coming out fairly soon, I believe. All right, Heavy Storm is the list. Storm. And I'm, and as one of the people that owns it, I feel semi-justified in doing it. Nope, Heavy, Heavy Storm is always one of those cards I think about every time I tuck it in a deck that I'm like... Much like when we played Cyberdrive, I'm like, when are you going away? When when will you be done possibly forever? <laughs> All right, very well. Uh, that was Loth. You are the third game, first round loser. Loth, what card do you want to ban? I've seen this card way too much in people's decks. I'm getting rid of Smashing Ground. Very well. Smashing oh, Ground I, is heated. I guess I'll play for I'm, I'm fine with that because I fucking lost. I, I, I lost the entire last round to that. Yeah. All right. What's that removal card you immediately replace it with? Frizzer. Okay. 
Yeah. Or back to square one. But, fi- I mean, Fissure technically has counterplay because Smashing is always the highest defense, so it's almost always your biggest dick monster yeah. unless something weird is happening. Whereas oh, Fissure, you can like, oh, I special summon a little baby monster. I dare you to Fissure me. Yeah. 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 Or there are those, uh, what is it? Um, you could back to square one. You could hammer it, blow, technically. It is a couple of options. Don't trio your opponent's side of boring. They have a defense position, high attack power monster. On there. Anyway, uh, that is our band, so I will see you guys when I go to do our opening. Um, we've it's it's uh, we did our math, and actually we're opening Cyber Dark Impact, allegedly the worst set Yu-Gi-Oh has ever had. Allegedly, and spoiler, and it's fifty-three not. packs of Dark Rev Three. <laughs> I actually, oh shut up, <laughs> God. Well, I mean, Robin, when Robin said that, that wasn't on camera, like in any way. I don't think so. That's fair. All right, I'll see you guys next time, audience. Goodbye. <laughs> Bye. Bye-bye now. Bye.